Hello everyone. For those who don't know, I'm Hannah Shaw and I'm an author and an illustrator. I make pitch books and chapter books. This is my latest book, which is the first in a series about a unicorn pig called Unipiggle. This story is called Unicorn Muddle and there are a lot more books coming. The stories are set in the magical kingdom of Twinkleland, where there are all sorts of magical creatures and characters. In each video, I'm going to show you how to draw some of these magical characters. This time, I'm going to show you how to draw a flying dragon called Goldie, who is toasting a marshmallow. For this draw along, you will need a drawing pencil, a drawing pen in black. You will also need A4 paper, or you can print off the drawing guide. For your colours, you can use pens, pencils, pastels or paint. and you'll need an eraser. Don't forget you can pause and rewind the video at any time if you make a mistake or I'm going too fast. So pick up your pencils and let's get ready to draw. This is Goldie the Dragon from the second Unipickle book, Dragon Trouble. You can either print off the drawing guide or you can have a go at drawing it all yourself. Okay, pencils at the ready. Press lightly with your pencil. So first of all, do a squashed oval, sort of in the centre of your paper at the bottom. And another squashed oval shape, overlapping that. A square for the nose, and a triangle for the end of the tail. And then draw two curved lines, joining up the tail to the body. These are the legs, little rectangles. And two arms at the front and then triangles for feet. These almond shapes are the wings and then two triangles on the head for the ears. Okay, there you have your drawing guide. Now those who have printed it out can start drawing with the pen. So we're going over the top of the line. We're drawing nostrils. These are the ears. They're kind of feathery. Two circles for the eyes. And at the end of the tail, you can draw a heart shape. Join the tail up to the body again. We can move on to the arms. And the dragon's hands, one's facing outwards, one inwards, because the dragon's going to be holding something in a minute. And then the legs and the toenails. And scales all along the back of the dragon. And lines on the tummy underneath the dragon all the way along. Now we can follow the shape of the wings. And we're going to draw half circle shapes out of them like so. And we're going to add some detail on the dragon's body as well. Some scales there. You can see I've drawn lines near the wings to make them look like they're moving. And the dragon's expression. What kind of expression are you going to give your dragon? So Goldie the dragon is toasting a marshmallow in this drawing. There we go. If you've drawn the drawing guide yourself, you can now rub out the pencil line. And start to add some colour. Goldie is a gold dragon, so I'm using oranges and yellows and some browns and reds. You can also use gold if you've got gold. Just adding little details and textures here and there. Shading. As you can see, I've speeded this up just to show you, but you can take time with your colour to make sure you get it just right. Here are the wings, and don't forget to add colour to your marshmallow. Is it going to be a pink marshmallow or a white marshmallow? The other thing you mustn't forget is to set your marshmallow on fire. There we go. And add some smoke coming out of Goldie's nostrils. Now I'd love to see your finished drawings so please do send them to me on Twitter or Instagram. Super job everyone! Remember, check out my website and the Usborne website for more activities. Bye-bye.